We all know that the NBA 2K community can get extremely toxic at times. But this right here, this might be one of the most toxic things that are actually happening in the 2K community right now. So basically what's happening is there's this guy that's going around and he's hacking YouTubers accounts, taking their PlayStation accounts, taking their Xbox accounts, going on and deleting all of their my players. He actually did this to shoot everyone who was a legend and deleted all of his players. Go ahead and check this out. Hey yo stream, tune the fuck in. Y'all stream, live stream, tune the fuck in. I just took this fucking Bruce Lee, Jackie Chan looking ass mother shoots account man tune the fuck in y'all let's get right tune the fuck in bro i just took this bum ass shoot legends account fucking bruce lee mother spend his vc as well you don't even i got a girlfriend you have no life for wasting your time you're in no life i'm not no life i'm doing him a favor now he can actually go outside and breathe fresh air. Like, he sits on his game all day and, and beats little kids, y'all. He's not good. Like, he's a Mexican virgin bitch, y'all. Anyways, uh, guys, follow my Instagram, man. Follow my Instagram. I'm a hack. Nadex, the Nadex, the f Cuban f -X. I will be hacking him. Chalk, you're next. Watch out. Cheeseaholic, you're f next, too. Like, don't worry, I will, I'm gonna hack them. Follow me on Twitter. No free clout! And G-Size, I'm coming for your ass, bro. You fucking no life. I'm coming for you, bro. This right here, this scenario makes me and everyone else who are part of the 2K community become ashamed of representing something like this. This guy took shoot everyone's account, took his YouTube account. I don't know if he took his YouTube account. I'm pretty sure he took his PSN and then streamed on his YouTube through his PSN. But nonetheless, this guy straight up just hacked shoot everyone's PSN or YouTube. I'm pretty sure it was just the PSN because if, if it was the YouTube, he probably would have changed all of the names and stuff like that. So it was probably just his PSN. Hacked his PSN, went live from PSN, and then started saying some pretty reckless things so shoot everyone for you guys who don't know is a legend on nba 2k20 which is obviously the highest rep you can get and he put a lot of time and a lot of work into getting to the highest rep on nba 2k20 now this guy went ahead and he hacked shoot everyone and he also also he deleted all of shoot everyone's players which by the way is something that i will never understand what you get out of that i'll never understand what that does for you as a person i'll never understand why you think that's going to build yourself some sort of notoriety why it's going to make people think that you're some cool guy on the internet but doing that is not something that is a smart move for you to try to grow in the community because clearly that's the reason why this guy did this this guy self-promoted his twitter instagram he self-promoted himself like seven eight times throughout the video and i had to blank it out because I'm sorry, but you do not deserve any recognition or any clout for doing this because this is embarrassing. I want you to take a step back and realize what you're doing. I want you to tell your parents what you're doing. What would your parents think of this? Hey, mom, I went ahead and I'm hacking YouTubers PSN accounts just because I want to, just because I, I sound like I'm angry at the world. This guy literally sounds like he's just angry at everything. Not only did he hack shoot everyone, but he also said that he was going to hack Chalk, he was going to hack g -Size, he was going to hack Cheeseaholic, and he was going to hack Nate Exy. Now, my problem with this is, is that obviously hacking isn't cool, but he made a lot of racial comments. He made a lot of racial slurs towards Shoot Everyone and towards Nate. Towards Shoot, he made a lot of racial slurs, and then towards Nate, he made a couple of those as well, which makes it a little concerning that this guy is actually a racist. This guy is actually racist and trying to hack these people's PSN accounts, trying to hack these people's accounts, and trying to take advantage of the situation. So he's trying to self-promo on every single one of these guys' channels, which, newsflash, is not going to work. Trust me, it is not going to work. Nobody's going to sit there and support someone who tries to take away from people who put in the work and put in the effort. And I don't wish ill will upon anyone, but this guy hacking people's accounts does not deserve anything. He does not deserve to get any followers. He does not deserve to grow any of his platforms. Just work for it. You don't need to hack people because you're jealous or because you're angry. I don't know. When he was talking about shoot everyone there, he said that shoot everyone's not good at the game. He just plays kids. 
so it made me think that maybe he lost the shoot in a park game got really angry maybe they exchanged some messages got really angry and then took it upon himself to hack shoot everyone but now he plans on basically hacking every single person within the nba 2k community so that's a little worrying it's a little concerning because this guy probably won't stop at anything and if i was anyone else in the 2k community including myself i would put some extra security on my accounts especially psn because psn has been known to get hacked so easily i don't know why that's a thing but with that being said that is going to bring the video to an end i'm not too sure why there's people out there trying to steal people's hard end work hard earned work and trying to just brag about it i'll never understand that i'll never come to a you know conclusion or some sort of an understanding of what people actually get out of doing this i'll never understand it it was a thing last year that a lot of people were getting hacked and now again it seems to be starting so anybody out there who plays 2k has a following or even doesn't even have a following make sure you guys lock up your accounts especially if you're higher reps because a lot of people are getting their accounts stolen and the 2k community is filled with a bunch of people who just want attention so make sure you guys do that i don't want to see any of my subscribers or anyone else get hacked i just don't want to see that it's not fun but i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure to drop a like and make sure you guys subscribe to the youtube channel thank you very much for watching i'll see you guys next time and peace